Yemen's answer to the movement has dismissed a so-called U.S. ceasefire plan as nothing new, saying it represents the Saudi vision. Movement spokesperson said the U.S. proposal doesn't include either ceasing Saudi Arabia's attacks on Yemen or ending its blockade on the country. Mohammed Abdul Salam stressed Riyadh and its allies will not be able to achieve through dialogue what they could not obtain through war and destruction. Earlier on Friday, the U.S. Special Envoy on Yemen said a plan for a nationwide ceasefire in the country has been uh, before the answer of the movement for a number of days now. Tim uh, Lender King claimed the movement is prioritizing a military offensive to take the region of Ma'arib. Saudi Arabia, along with some regional allies, waged a war on Yemen in 2015 with the aim of reinstating a Riyadh-friendly regime. Press TV correspondent Abdul Latif Al Washali says the so-called U.S. ceasefire proposal is not an offer for peace, but another conspiracy to legitimize the Yemen blockade. Uh, they have uh, offered nothing. They haven't mentioned a ceasefire or a lift of the blockade. So this is not a peace offer. It's uh, just another, as the uh, spokesman of Ansarullah movement described, is just another conspiracy maybe to legalize, legalize the, the war and the siege imposed on Yemenis for the uh, sixth and we're about to enter the uh, seventh year of war. Ye the Yemeni army is now capable of uh, hitting uh, uh, severely Saudi Arabia. We've seen the uh, uh, the exception. Uh, we've seen the new missiles, new types of missiles, the new drones. They're uh, very sophisticated. So we believe that the Yemeni army will continue escalating its uh, uh, operations against Saudi Arabia.